Centre Parks is all about families uh, and my family is hugely important to me. I've got a little granddaughter who's 10 and I want her environment to be the best it possibly can be. So what we do now makes a real impact and a real difference on the environment she'll have when she's older. I think we've all become very much aware as to our impact on the environment and reducing that impact is hugely important. At Centre Parks we've been able to use an anaerobic digester which uses waste gas to produce heat and electricity for the village. The heat goes to our main buildings, to our pool, to our spa, and the electricity is used throughout the village, including our lodges. The anaerobic digester plant is very local to the village, and that means it benefits the local community and local farmers in terms of the provision of waste materials for the plant to feed it, and the travel distance is very, very small as well. We grow maize and rye uh, in the fields locally and we like it to be grown as close as possible. It's better in terms of the cost of haulage but also environmentally. So it would be within probably seven or eight miles of the silage as the maximum. This is maize and silage, feed about 100 tonnes a day. And then it goes up the pipe and then down into the big tank. That is, we call it digestase, there's methane that's released as the biological material breaks down. And inside that tank, the methane goes in, into the dome on top the gas that goes to centre parks goes underground, a pipe comes across and then a few kilometres across the fields to centre parks there. And the relationship with centre parks has been great for us but hopefully for centre parks as well. And having an end user that can use both the heat and electricity uh, that we produce is fantastic uh, and it means that virtually nothing is going to waste environmentally. Centre parks is absolutely committed to reducing its carbon use. This is a great way of doing that with a low carbon provision of heat and electricity for the village.